Hey, myself Dr. Rabia Zarwin and I'm back with another important and informative video. Hope you're all doing well. As we all know, the greatest wealth is health. Health is not valued till the sickness comes in. But don't worry, I'm here to make your life a little easy. If you're suffering from hypothyroidism, I would be telling you 9 foods that you should avoid. Hypothyroidism can be a tricky condition to manage and what you eat can interfere with your treatment. Some nutrients heavily interfere with the functioning of the thyroid gland and certain foods can inhibit your body's ability to absorb the replacement hormones that you may be taking as a part of your thyroid treatment. As with many health conditions, some factors are out of your control, including your family history and the environment around you. But diet also plays a major and prominent role. And since you are the in charge of your plate, you can decide thyroid friendly foods to choose. So while there is no such thing as hypothyroidism diet that will make you well, eating smart can help you feel better despite the condition. Here are 9 food items to limit or avoid if you are suffering from hypothyroidism. Foods with soy including tofu. Studies suggest that soy rich food may inhibit the activity of the enzyme that make thyroid hormones. There is a concern over the potential negative effects that certain compounds in soy called isoflavonoids may have on your thyroid. Some researchers believe that too much soy may increase your risk for hypothyroidism. So there are no specific dietary guidelines but some research suggests that consumption of soy may interfere with your ability to absorb thyroid medications. Cruciferous vegetables like broccoli and cabbage. Cruciferous vegetables such as broccoli and cabbage are full of fibers and other nutrients but they may interfere with the production of thyroid hormones. If you have an iodine deficiency, it's good or I should say ideal to limit your intake of sprouts, cauliflower, turnips because research suggested digesting these vegetables may block the thyroid's ability to utilize iodine which is essential for normal thyroid function. Gluten found in bread, pasta and rice. Those with hypothyroidism may want to consider minimizing their intake of gluten a protein found in foods that is processed. Gluten-free diet may have clinical benefits for women with hyperthyroidism. If you choose to eat gluten, be sure to choose whole grains varieties. Whole grain varieties of bread, pasta and rice, which are high in fiber and other nutrients. It can help improve bowel irregularity, a common symptom of hyperthyroidism. Also be sure to take your hyperthyroidism medication several hours before or after eating a high fiber food to prevent them from interfering with the absorption of your synthetic thyroid hormone. Fatty food such as butter, meat and all things fried. Fats have been found to disrupt the body's ability to absorb thyroid hormone replacement medicines. Fats may also interfere with the thyroid ability to produce hormones as well. Some healthcare professional recommends that you should cut out all the fried food and reduce your intake of fats from sources such as butter, mayonnaise and fatty cuts of meat. Sugary food like the delicious chocolate cake. Already having the craving? Hypothyroidism can cause body's metabolism to slow down. That means it's easy to put on pounds if you aren't careful. You want to avoid foods with excess amount of sugar because it's a lot of calories with no such useful nutrients. It's best to reduce the amount of sugar you are eating or try to eliminate it completely from your diet. Processed and frozen foods because processed foods tend to have a lot of sodium and people with hypothyroidism should avoid sodium. Do you know having an underactive thyroid increases person's risk for high blood pressure and too much sodium further increases the risk. Excess fiber from the beans, legumes and vegetables. Getting enough fiber is good for you, but too much can complicate your hypothyroidism treatment. The government's daily guideline recommended for adults up to the age of 50 should take 25 to 38 grams of fibers a day. Amounts of dietary fiber from whole grains, vegetables, fruits, beans and legumes that go above this level affects your digestive system and can interfere with your absorption of thyroid hormone replacement. Caffeine.
study suggested that caffeine is found to, to block the absorption of thyroid hormone replacement. People who were taking their thyroid medication with their morning coffee had uncontrolled thyroid levels. You should at least wait for 30 minutes after taking your medications before having a cup of tea. And the last one, alcohol. Alcohol doesn't play well with your thyroid. Alcohol consumption can wreak havoc on both thyroid hormone levels in the body and the ability of the thyroid to produce hormone according to a study in Indian Journal of Endocrinology and Metabolism alcohol appears to have toxic effects on your thyroid gland and suppresses the ability of the body to use thyroid hormone ideally. People with hypothyroidism should cut out alcohol completely or drink in careful moderation. I hope I made your life a little easy. So if you liked what you heard or learned something new, be sure to click the like button, subscribe to my channel and also hit the bell icon so you get to notified every time I upload something new.